Hello and welcome to Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. I thought it was time to put something new on the channel. And by new I mean something 14 years old. It will be 15 this November, but uh, that's a while away. Since they announced Bloodlines 2, I thought I'd revisit this one. Yeah. Sounded like a good time. Yes, the world of darkness is a place where immortal monsters pull the strings of humanity. Yes. Uh, let's go and just do it. Hmm. For some reason, I thought that I remembered more options than this. The obvious choice is to go Malkavian. I think I will. Just because uh, there aren't already enough people playing Malkavian woman in this on YouTube. Yes, there are. There's a lot of people playing Malkavian Woman on YouTube. Let's go with... Uh, should be Karen. Yeah. That's a name. Alright. Uh, hell, if I remember what's actually good for anything. And I would like to have... Let's make friends. And let's be witty. And intelligent. I should probably also get some perception in, that's not bad to have. Alright, uh, subterfuge, intimidation, dodge, roll. Dodge isn't bad, let's put a point in that. Let's do some security and let's do some melee. IP. Oh! No, oh, those, are, those are total abilities. I. I completely misread the situation again and that's good uh, but, uh, let's do a little bit of uh, scholarship as well we will be a scholar and an absolute madman okay that's invisibility that's evil evil laughter uh, Ooh. I mean, that's fun. Uh, is there anything else in it? Can I accept now? <laughs> when I last played, I actually had it when 1280 by 1024 <laughs> monitor, I think. That's the default that the game is able to scale to, but an official patch allows for HD and all that. Native widescreen and whatever they call it. Oh my god, that's a lot of condom wrappers. Poor Karen. That's how it goes. My fellow kindred, my apologies for disrupting any business or interfering with prior engagements you may have had this evening. It's unfortunate that the affair that gathers us together tonight is a troubling one. We are here because the laws that bind our society, the laws that are the fabric of our existence, have been broken. As prince, I am within my rights to grant or deny the kindred of this city the privilege of siring. Many of you have come to me seeking permission, and I have endorsed some of these requests. However, the accused that sits before you tonight was not refused permission. Indeed, my permission was never sought at all. They were caught shortly after the embrace of this child. It pains me to announce the sentence, as up to tonight I considered the accused a loyal and upstanding member of our organization. But as some of you may know, the penalty for this transgression is death. Know that I am no more adjudicator than I am a servant to the law that governs us all. Let tonight's proceedings serve as a reminder to our community that we must adhere to the code that binds our society. 
lest we endanger all of our blood. Forgive me. Let the penalty commence. That was a very clean cut. You couldn't even see the blood. Which leads to the fate of the ill-begotten progeny. Well, there Without would have desire, been a lot Most child are doomed to walk the, the earth hell? never knowing their place, their responsibility, and most importantly, the laws they must obey. Therefore, I have decided that this is bullshit! If Mr. Rodriguez would let me finish, I have decided to let this kindred live. They shall be instructed in the ways of our kind and be granted the same rights. Let no one say I am unsympathetic to the plights and causes of this community. I thank you all for attending these proceedings, and I hope their significance is not lost. Good evening. I love how casually some of these vampires dress. Your sire. Tragic. My apologies. But you see, there is a strict code of conduct that all of us must... must... adhere to if we wish to survive. When someone, anyone, breaks these laws, they undermine the well-worn fabric of our centuries-old society. Understand my predicament. Allowing you to live makes me directly responsible for your subsequent behavior. So, what I'm offering is not generosity, but the opportunity to transcend the fate woven by your sire. This is your trial. You will be brought to Santa Monica. There, you will meet an agent by the name of Mercurio. He will provide the details of your labor. I've shown you great clemency. Prove it was more than a wasted gesture, fledgling. Don't come back until you do. Good evening. All right. It's time to play the game. <laughs> what a scene, man. Hooey. <laughs> then it is ploppy out here like a naked baby in the woods. <laughs> How about that? Ah, look, you know, it's probably a lot for you to take in, so uh, why don't you let me show you the ropes? What do you say? Sure, I could be reminded. What? Oh, man. And you're a goddamn Malkavian, too. Wow. You really are fucked. I'm Jack. What's important is I'm offering help. You make it back from Santa Monica with your hide and we'll trade life stories, okay? Till then, I got about this much time. You wear out. I really should uh, read this uh, out uh, loud because they are very good. Anyway, I shall take. I shall undertake your talk. Tutelage. Now, we ain't got much time, but I figure somebody should fill you in on the bare bones stuff at least, you know. Could save your hide. You look wobbly. You even had a drink yet? About what beverage do you oh, babble? Oh man, we're popping a cherry here! Ha ha ha! Oh, you're gonna love this. Alright, check it out. Blood? It's your new rack of lamp, your new champagne, but your new fucking heroin, kid. <laughs> Get ready though, cause hey, it's never as sweet as the first time. Sweet like a prom date? Down around the corner there, I saw this human. Poor SOB can't find his car. <laughs> How do I do this, right. Dread You go down there, casual like. You creep up on him, you bear those little fangs and feed. Don't worry if you weren't captain of the wrestling team or something, because it'll come so naturally you think you've done it a thousand times already. Will he then carry this curse in his veins? <laughs> Forget that comic book crap, kid. It don't work that way. Now go for it. Be sure, though, and this is important, so listen up. Be sure not to train him dry, okay? It might be hard to resist, but don't kill him. I go to drain the luscious liquid. Yes, bloodies. But 
makes the world go round. Yes. Alright, cool. Are you doing okay? You alright? You alright, buddy? What key was I supposed to press? This one. Like, yeah, I'll do the tutorial and then I just ignore all the keys that are actually directed to be used in this. I mean, it looked to be good. No longer as wobbly, right? How did, what do you think, Jack? Feeling that blood bubbling inside you, lifting you up. That's it, kid. That's what it's all about right there. So spooky, and when do I choose the color of my cape? Alright now, you got the blood, you're feeling all kick-ass, feeling better than your best day living, but wait, it gets better. All kindred, kindred, that's a our word for vampire. All kindred have a few things in common. Things that set them right square above humans on the food. Jane. Tell me this tale. Like sharper senses, a body that can take a beating, and if you play your cards right, eternal life. That's no sure bet, but still, a chance at immortality is not a bad deal. And that's just for starters. French benefits for joining the club. My life line will go on forever? Well, you can still be destroyed, but forget the books and the movies. Garlic? Worthless. A cross? Pfft. Shove it right up their ass. <laughs> the steak? Only if it catches you in the heart, and then it just paralyzes you. Running water? Eh, that's no problem. I bathe. Occasionally. Now, a shotgun blast to the head. Oh, that's trouble, boy. Fire? That's real trouble. Sunlight? Well, you catch a sunrise and it's all over, kiddo. Get it? Like a bad sunburn. Okay, now. Going in. Yes. Uh, the bottom of your screen is the use icon. This icon appears. Yes. Okay. That makes sense. Yes. Let's close the door. Close the door. Bye, Jack. It was nice seeing you. The mouse sensitivity is a bit high. At least it felt like it was a bit high. This seems better. I don't feel like it's doing as performing as much of a mess as it was before. Supposed to come up here, right? Ooh. Your feats and combination learn blah 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 blah. Inspection is a feat. It is a combination of perception and investigation. It allows you to see hidden and secret things. For example, the lockpick in front of me. Ah, yes. Okay. No. He is the button for picking things up. Come oh, hey, you're here. here. Stay away from the window. Oh, it's a Sabat raid. Sabat. Spare this shit till later. Uh, the Sabbat. Well, uh, they're mostly mindless, bloodthirsty assholes. That's all you need to know for now, alright? Where does this path lead? The Sabbat got wind of the gathering here, so they figured they'd raise a little hell and put a little heat on the new prince. Tell me of the Chester Prince. No time for political rundown. Job one, get out of here alive. Sabat might be mindless, but they hit like a Mack truck, like raging savages. Nothing a fledgling like he wants to mess with. If not the sword. Shh, shh. Heads up. Back away. So pop bastards. All right, we gotta have a moose out the back quick. I'll stay and keep a watch out. You get us into the office. The door's around the corner here. I shall invade this orifice. Yes. That is that is not what I usually think of when I think of a door. 
And no, I did not actually read any of that. Okay, I don't... I still don't know what I... How it actually works. Thanks, Jack! I feel like you put a whole lot of belief uh, in me. Shortcut. Well, nicely done, though. Not exactly an angel in life, were you? I knew my share cool. of demons. Now, if you want a lesson on how really not to act, take notes from those sabbat assholes. You're a big bad vampire. Yeah, great, congrats. Now keep it to yourself. You go roar and you beat your chest and that's what you can expect. I hope you're back in Bloodlands too. I love you, Jack. Why need we hide our nature? It's the same reason you don't let humans see you feeding. It's why the wolf doesn't want the sheep to know he's there. It's also why you don't go juggling dumpsters or outrun the 815 from Sacramento. And it's, and it's why you didn't know any of this when you woke up this morning. My eyes are beginning to Keep open. Keep our secret secret and you make things easier on all of us. We're living in the age of cell phone cameras. Fuck ups ain't tolerated. Makes sense enough, right? Well, it ain't a casual thing for a fledgling like you. My mind is beginning to ground. Shine a light that and explain. Party back there with the guy in the suit and the gorilla gorilla. The assholes that put your sire to death. That's the Camarilla. They make a tidy business out of enforcing vampire laws like this one. This Camarilla are my comments? Mm, yeah. I'll tell you what I think some other time, maybe. I like to let people form their own opinions. My minds have many opinions. All right, now don't worry, because I know the area a little. You know what? I'm glad we're in this situation, you and I. It illustrates a point. You gotta utilize your surroundings. Paint me a you picture. What you gotta do. Theft, destruction of property, breaking and entering. <laughs> These will be the least of your sins before the night's out. So look around here. We gotta get out the back there through that magnetically sealed door. There must be a key someplace. I shall seek this key. Uh, to this that icon to the left indicates that you're in a combat area. Anything goes. Respect the masquerade. Vampire neutral ground. No combat or disciplines are allowed. Except blood buff when blood picking in masquerade areas. Breaking the masquerade can carry dire consequences such as unwanted attention of vampire hunters. After five masquerade violations, your game is over. But I'd rather not like that. Yes, let's not do that. So what does this say? Fast forward, chop chop. I think I accidentally blood buffed. That's fine. So... Let's... Go for safe. Chop chop. Uh, unlock. And... Home. I wonder if I could go to, I probably go bit from out there as well. Okay, what do we have here? Yeah. There we go. Did it? take that key card and head out the back. I'll meet you out in the alley there. I'm gonna check out things from top side. I will do this deed. There's probably a hacking mini game as well that I don't remember at all because it has been a while since I last played this game. It was most certainly not on this computer. And I don't remember if it was on my laptop either. So it's entirely possible that it has been a few days. A few days? No, I mean like a few years. Like, I think it might have been in the Otis. Yeah. So I don't remember a lot about this game, but enough to spoil everything for everyone watching. So I'm, I'm not do that. Unlife, these sabbat vatos. You get winged? Hey, hey, look at them potholes. Those will close up soon enough. Better feed though. <laughs> There's someone down the stairs here. It's not the freshest catch, but he'll do. Does blood have vintage and bouquet? Nope. When it comes to feeding, it's quality blood you're looking for, not the quantity. Bums and lowlife don't pack the same punch that a healthy, well-bred human will. 
juice bags with a pedigree. That's the good stuff. But you gotta take what you can get. You ever had a PhD kid? Ooh, that's good stuff. The thirsty rarely avoid an oasis. Remember what I said, though. Don't kill them. At least not the innocent ones. You're a monster now. Make no mistake. One of the damned and the fallen. You need to hold on to every last shred of humanity you have. What if I train him drunk? Innocence and innocent. You kill one, even a worthless bum, even by accident, and it's gonna cost you a piece of your own humanity. Bring you closer to that beast you got welling up inside you. Yes, the dark beast coiled beneath the surface. It's always there, waiting to take over. When it does, it's like a wild animal wearing your skin. Desperate, scared, reckless. He'll do anything to survive, and it's you that has to deal with the consequences. What if a human tries to harm me? I, I, I said innocent humans. If some asshole levels a 12 gauge your way, you drain him, skin him, and bash in his skull. Self preservation is a vital part of humanity, after all. My favorite part, in fact. <laughs> Brain skin bash and dash. The only way to fight the beast is to keep in touch with your humanity and don't go hungry. It's a fine line. Such lines divide the world from All the right, last. Now go feed. Careful though. He's gonna drain fast. Aye aye. Hello friend, are you down here? Hi friend. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Yeah, he trains real fast. I'll just let him be. I don't need to be at full blood. He will be fine. Not quite as good, huh? Yeah, you could do worse. There's some rats down the way. You think I'm kidding? You can survive feeding on animals if you can stomach that kind of thing. <laughs> His neck tasted like your breath smells. Try. I need to floss the flannel from my fangs. Okay, uh. <laughs> Humans don't react well when they see rats suck them. Well, who is surprised by that? Was the rat here? Where, where is this magic rat that I seek? Are you the magic rat that I seek? That is the magic rat that I sought. That's dead rat now. Little snacky bum bum. Hi! Hey Jack, how are you feeling, Jack? <laughs> you rat sucker! <laughs> hey, I don't care what you do, but just so you know, polite vampire society looks down on that kind of thing. Etiquette demands they pass the salt for my rodent feast. Keep it down, got someone around the way here. They do have to pass the salt. Only Not one. Too much of a threat by himself, but you never know if there's more in shouting range. You're gonna have to sneak past. Where should I sneak? The building across from us with the garage door. There's some double doors on the far side. I'll meet you inside. Just stay low and stick to the shadows. And don't let him see you. Now you see me, then you don't. Go. go on. Alright. Uh, the meter to the last thing is proximity of enemies. Yes. I am invisible. Bloody door, close already. I have my bro this completely straight, I don't know what you mean. Now where is this vampy vampy? Over there. That didn't look good for him, did it? Inside here. Seems that shovel head outside just got separated from his pack. He's wounded too. Go take care of him. Don't worry, he's probably greener than you. How can you see his shade from here? Savat, you see, they don't have the most rigorous training program. In fact, that poor sod is lucky if he knows he's a vampire. My own green bank is still fairly fresh. He's probably just turned and beaten over the head. They like to do that, make shock troops, cannon fodder. Put him out of his misery. Ashes to ashes, dust he to dust. Is a vampire, so be ready. Vampire, no, he meets Go his get maker. Him. Getting. 
To engage in unarmed combat, you need to equip your fist and then attack. Okay. Boom. Let's beat him silly. When I meant let's beat him silly, I didn't realize we were beating him that silly. I'm gonna take fire iron. Yay! And that should be under here? Oh wait, that's where... Armor goes. <laughs> Let's close the door behind me. Why did you open this door as well? Don't you think there's too many open doors? How do I close the door? Savannah going all out. Better head underground, avoid straight bullets. This plan is fine to me. All right, head down into the basement through the grate in there. Keep that tire iron handy. I'll be there in a minute. Sneaky, sneaky. I can't go. I can't flush. This is a really dirty room. I do not recommend anyone living here. Luckily, this is not a living space. I don't recommend anyone work here. In fact, I don't recommend this place. I did that wrong. Oh, I literally did that wrong. The tutorial is very insistent, I do not do this wrong. Be sneaky sneaky sneaksters. There we go. I just I just dust sure hi. On. Sounds like the sabots getting scattered. I'm gonna keep an ear to the ground. Be careful going forward here. Could be a whole mess of them hold up. More fun then. Yes. Uh right, plot buff is another ability common to all members. Gives you the bonus to all your physical attributes. Uh, cool. Let's buff that blood then. How do I down like that? Okay, I am all specsing, but I cannot see his aura. No, you can. I didn't do that quite as efficient as I was hoping. I lost my wits. Hi, Jack. I think they're clearing out. No need to go stirring up the hornet's nest till we know the score, though. Head through here. Come to an elevator around the way. Till our next encounter at the elevator. There. Don't let them catch you. I'll do the fishing. Put this tape. The tape in my catch, not the other way around. In fact, they'll be the catch of the day. Obfuscate here, yeah. okay. That makes a certain amount of sense. But why have invisibility if you're not gonna go invisible? Okay, and now I have to do the dementia thing. Well, hysteria. I like that song. <laughs> Can I kill him now? Bashes to bashes, pass to pass. Do I still have obfuscate on, or has it run out now? Did he hear the ones I was... <laughs> that 
That didn't work quite as I was hoping. I think what happened was they stepped on one of these. Which caused me some trouble. Close the door behind me. <laughs> Fucking humans. Gang bangers protecting their turf. Oh man. I'm here thinking it's Sabat moving up in here. It's the fucking locals about to take one for the hood. Do we lick these locals? Yeah, they probably seen too much. Here, take this 38. Fucking pea shooter, but a few shots in it'll take down a human. These kinds of peas are undoubtedly deadly. Well, I'm gonna want it back, so don't go die and lose it. I don't use guns much. They're noisy, they're clumsy, practically useless against vampires, but still. A kindred's got to keep up with the times. And in modern day Los Angeles, that means coming strapped. Firearms sound foolish well, and feeble. Yeah, you know, some are more lethal than others, of course. But watch out for those shotguns. Ouch, those things can smart, I tell you. I'll make sure to buy best any boomsticks. Clear out what's left of them. Can't have them running their mouths about any of this. I gotta make sure there's no stragglers around outside. I will do this deed. Okay. Yes. We are almost done with the tutorial, I believe. Uh, I need to start trying to right click everything because that apparently does not do. Okay. You want me to just shoot the bottle? I didn't shoot the bottle I intended to. Ha! See? Gonna go now? Or do I need to tell you that... Look, Come on up. I'll meet you. Look, all the bottles are over. Can I go now? How do I get to keep going? Oh right, the elevator. <laughs> I'm dumb. Probably wasted a fair bit more ammo on this than I should have. Well, hi. All right. Uh, there might be humans in here. That is a human. Be honest here. Oh, you really? Is that how you want to do this? Okay. Combat is not the only solution for sticky situations. You can also use your feats and disciplines in dialogue. When you are able to do this, your responses will show up in different colors. Right? Dementation, persuasion, seduction, intimidation. Right. Hi. How are we doing? It, kiddo. Just like that, and it's all over. Everyone slinks back to their corners of the city for the night. Surely this blood trauma continues. Until the next night, when the Camarilla finds some way to strike back, Barry Dodge spinning all that, and so on, and so on, and so on. These are the nightly battles of this ancient game. Well, to be honest, you came at a, well, an interesting time, let's say. The Camarilla, the Sabat. Now, in L.A., these are the new kids on the block. There's already plenty of kindred had stakes down in California long before them. Now, we got every ancient kindred rivalry playing out all over the city. A lot of tension out there. A lot of fear. A lot of jittery, high-strung predators clinging to their little pieces of eternity. Hell is my eternal madness. Oh, boy. Oh, I think they're looking for you outside. Guess you've got a cab to catch. Was hoping to fill you in on a little bit more, but ah hell, you'll figure it all out. If you make it back, stop in at the last round. It's this bar downtown here. 
I'll fill you in on the politics. <laughs> now that's the stuff that'll kill you. <laughs> Good luck. I want your beard. We will be there soon. Yes. Go out the door. You have received two experience points. Dun 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 dun. Cool. It's not like I had to do that immediately, right? Okay, we have been arranged the haven. And we are here. And I think this is where I will call the first episode. And we'll start fresh next time. Going into the city proper instead of just uh, wandering around the place. Being like big sillies. Anyway, on that note, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. I oh I don't have to do the other thing in this, do I? No, that's that's work, that's an XCOM thing. Yeah.